The Words of This Life with Apostle Grace Lurega. We are in the age of what we call the age of information overload. There's just so much information that is available to us, so much data that is available to us, that it has broken the order of how man was created to think. Back in the day, people used to use mobile phones to call for purpose. You only serve the basic function to keep basic things moving. And now our social media has come. Sometimes I wonder, how do you keep up with every information coming? And you have all these news that are coming left, right, and center, whether they are fake or junk. If you watch your body, you say, you know what, I'm not going to eat junk food. If you can take time to watch your body, even exercise it, what are you doing for the mind that is receiving junk? Internet has now been recognized that it's an addiction. The biggest percentage of people in the world are actually addicted. This which was supposed to serve them has now become their goal. Some people can't even be away from their phone for 10 minutes. They can lose anything, but not their phone. You know, you're no longer emotional. Somebody has lost someone, you send an emoji of tears, and then somebody has gotten a job, congratulations, and then you clap and then put a dancing woman in a red dress. You know, you're even so emotionally displaced. The effect of a video game on a little child now is like somebody who takes drugs. And that's the generation we're in right now. Men cannot think for themselves. They cannot effectively process information. They cannot effectively utilize information. They no longer have the space to meditate and think for themselves because they are feeding and feeding. And the effects of that overload are that now people have gotten to a point where you have so much information, but your brain cannot retain it. It's not trained to allow the right processes of a man who meditates to take place. They can't contemplate anymore. We are on Facebook only for the gospel to allow that Christian who just wants to access God and preach the gospel to get them. If we're done, you have no business knowing which car I drive, where I live, what I eat, how I sleep. That's irrelevant. We are running out of time. Millions and millions of people are dying every day. Join our online family, spread the love, and follow us on our Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Finero, make manifest.